A curfew is in place tonight for anyone under age 18 in the city of Covington in West Tennessee. This after a family's home was destroyed by a fire likely caused by fireworks, according to authorities. Action News 5's Stephanie Douglas spoke with the family about their quick escape. You wouldn't never expect yourself to be in that predicament. And as fast as the fire spread, like, I don't know, it's just something you see in a movie. As a late night blaze burned through Cleotha Fulton's Covington home on the 4th of July, Fulton says his family of six only had minutes to escape wearing just the clothes on their backs. We pushed the window unit out and we started putting the keys out through the window and then I started screaming for help. He says three good Samaritans helped them to safety. Covington police says four separate fire departments responded to the fire on Best Street. While putting out the fire, witnesses told detectives suspects driving a red car were shooting fireworks from the vehicle. Fulton says moments before the blaze, everyone was in bed but heard a loud bang outside. But we didn't really pay too much attention because, you know, it was the last so a lot of fireworks going off, so we um we just kind of ignored it. Five minutes later, Fulton says smoke and flames could be seen rising outside the window. Although his family lost everything, including their cars, he feels blessed no one was hurt. I'm, I'm just happy we all made it up. As for the suspects who shot the fireworks, Covington detectives and arson investigators are working to identify the vehicle and those who are inside. In Covington, Stephanie Douglas, Action News 5.